Hey guys, this is Ritesh Arora and I'm here to talk about this beautiful, beautiful camera that we have in front of us. It's Fuji x 4 I bought this camera very recently. I bought this camera like six months back. So I'll tell you what I bought a Fuji XC4 and I bought three lenses with this, which is 23mm 1.4, uh, 50mm f2.0, and very basic lens, which is 1024 uh, f4. I have been a Fuji user uh, from quite a long now and I have used Fuji X-H1, I have used Fuji x 3 I have used and this is the third camera. So uh, let me tell you this thing that this camera feels very light in your hands. If you are shooting handheld, you won't get tired very easily. Your hands won't hurt very easily and it, it has a nice grip than the Fuji X-T3, I would say, uh, they've done a great work in making this script and as I told you, it feels really light. And talking about this flip-out screen, it really helps you while shooting videos and it also helps you while taking photos at a lower angle. So let me just get into the specifications of this camera. This is an APAC image sensor and uh, it is a 4K mirrorless camera, it shoots 4K at 60 frames per second, it shoots 4K at 30, 24, 28. So talking about the high speed recording, it shoots 240 frames per second at 1920 into 1080. But I must say this 240 frames per second really helps you out if you are shooting two videos. Also let me talk about these new batteries which are introduced by Fujifilm in this camera. Uh, we had a lot of complaints about the batteries of Fuji x 3 p and x 1 they used to drain very fastly but this new battery uh, in this Fuji x 4 helps you shooting for long hours uh, as I can see on their website that you can shoot around 600 frames at economic mode and you uh, may also be able to shoot uh, 500 pictures, 500 frames uh, at normal mode. Uh, I haven't tried it yet, but I will uh, let you know about it if we can do that or not. So the battery life when you're shooting video is uh, around 85 minutes. You can shoot continuously 85 minutes if you're shooting at 4K. You can shoot continuously uh, uh, around 95 minutes if you're shooting at full HD 60 frames per second. So let me also talk about this new film mode that we have in this camera which is a turn up these fan pass. It uh, really gives you an edge when you are at the edit table. Uh, so let me just get into uh, the lenses. Uh, let me just talk about the lenses which I bought with this camera. I have been a fan of this 23mm f1.4. I love the quality of this lens. Uh, I have been using this lens for quite a long now. It gives you a crisp image, it gives you a crisp video quality um, and it's a great lens I must say. Uh, the only drawback uh, I would say about this lens is its autofocus. Uh, it's not that fast as compared to the other lenses of Fujifilm. So let me just show you uh, the autofocus of this uh, lens. Uh, you'll uh, get to know uh, what I'm talking about. Let's see this. Here. See this. And here. So it is not that fast. If they could just improve uh, the autofocus of this lens slightly, it would be a great lens. Uh, let's talk about the 50mm. As I've already told you that this lens has a brilliant, brilliant, fast autofocus. It also feels really uh, light. This is a very, very light lens. Uh, let's talk about this uh, another lens which I bought uh, with this, uh, which is 1024. It gives you great wider shots, and yeah, I mean it is a good lens. Uh, the quality of 1024 slightly degrades when you shoot at night. That's what I have felt. That's what 
is my uh, observation of this lens. Overall, I mean, I must say that this camera is a beast when you're shooting videos, when you're shooting photos. It really gives you a great footage, it really gives you great pictures, great, great pictures. And I've been loving this camera. I've been a Sony user, I've been a Canon user, but this camera is something. So let me just show you some pictures which I have clicked with this camera. So that is it guys. I hope uh, you like this video and I hope that you would want to see more such videos coming out i will be uh, like uploading a lot of videos like these and i will be uploading a lot of more content on this uh, youtube channel if you have any questions any queries uh, i would be happy to help you out so thank you uh, this was ritesh arora uh, hope to see you in the next video